Hello everyone, welcome to the world of smart investments. In the past video, you can see those videos above here. We talked about Warren Buffett mistake on Kraft Heinz deal. Today, I'd like to introduce you to new video in series Billionaire's Mistake about David Einhorn mistake. My name is Lyubomir Yavorsky. I am general partner investor of Equity Capital Partners. David Einhorn is one of Wall Street's most closely watched investors. Einhorn has hedge fund Greenwhite Capital, which has 7 billion in assets and has posted a 15.4% net return since inception in May 1996. Greenwhite is most notable for its short selling of Lehman Brothers stock prior Lehman Brothers collapse in 2008. His hedge fund Greenwhite Capital posted a record loss plunging more than 34%. Most of all his losses came from investments in value trap such as Metwife spin-off Brighthouse Financial. Brighthouse Financial Incorporated is a United States based provider of annuity products and life insurance products through independent distribution channel. Let's look at the Bright House closely. Remember, the first question you ask yourself, does this company have a long-term sustainable competitive advantage? If you look at service, services of Bright House Financial, you will see that the company sells insurance policies. It doesn't own a brand or monopoly in its industry. As a rule, people buy insurance based on price. Few consumers think about brand choosing life insurance. A tough competition reigns in the American wife insurance market. Many insurance companies compete mainly in price. In such situation, a long-term competitive advantage is almost impossible to acquire, especially for a new company. After that, you could end up talking about Bright House Financial. It's understandable the prospects of Bright House are not so bright. But perhaps we are wrong in our judgment. Therefore, let's look at the key financial indicators of this company. First of all, pay attention for return on equity, return on assets and return on invested capital. We must look for stability and desirable growing trend. I remind you that our key goals, return on equity and return on invested capital, must be more than 20%. Return on assets, as for financial company, insurance and financial company, must be more than 1%. Secondly, Let's look at the dynamics of revenue and net profit. Where is stability? Where is stability and growing trend? Here we see chaotic fluctuations. That's key indicators confirm our idea that the company is not good investment opportunity. But the biggest mistake, from my point of view, was the purchase of shares of Bright House Financial at the price $64 per share in 
2017. You must understand, at the moment of spin-off, that is like IPO, company has a high price as possible. Probably David Einhorn did not think so. To avoid such mistake, you need understand every step in this mistake. You need learn from mistakes of billionaires like Warren Buffett, like David Einhorn or others. We must learn from these mistakes. If this video is valuable for you, please subscribe to this channel. We produce two new videos every week. Share this video with your friends, your colleagues. Please write comment below this video. I read every comment. See you next video.